Hello everybody and welcome back to Somo. I'm absolutely freaking terrified because we've got to go into the unhappy place. I'm I'm pretty sure. Like we have to find a security cipher. Go downstairs and reset the router. No, no. Oh, okay. So there was an elevator in that room, I remember. In that terrible room over there. <laughs> Which, you know, obviously this this door wasn't really gonna help me, but it made me feel better. Anyway, I'm terrified. I'm absolutely terrified. And I really, really, really don't wanna go in there. But I am basically obligated to finish this game. I told you all I would, and so I have to. Even though it's not regular updates by any means. <sighs> Cause you don't look at things. If we see things, don't look at them. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathway already etched into the base. So if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent it. It is built model. off me. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. Truly sentient machines, thinking they are people, is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Mm. That inspires me with confidence. What are these? Nothing. Come here, please. Come here. It's free. Oh, is this maybe, um, what's in the ark, maybe? Can I read the book? An extra size. So, you're not worried that there are other Simons or Catherines running around out there? Oh! Now I am. Oh, jeez. Jeez, Simon. Some thoughts are better left alone. These Buddhas, nice. Stepping on binders. Oh, jeez. That doesn't look healthy. All right, I'm stalling. It's fine. This was an exercise room. There's a door I can open over. Two doors I can open over. I wonder here. what the real Simon would have thought if he knew about me. Uh, what do you mean? You do know about yourself. No, I, I mean the real Simon, the human Simon. Going by your reactions, I'd say he'd be pretty upset. Okay, so somebody's been locked in there. <laughs> Where'd you see lights for? Catherine Chen, Catherine's room. Hey, that's my room. Do you want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's my place. If I open that and there's something out there. Journal. Emo again retested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way, like someone had specifically created it for WoW to steal. When it activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as, an, as a simulation inside the digital space. The presentation shocked Reed and was quickly terminated. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. After dissecting the vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that WoW copied my capsule project to construct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction except for one point, where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs. The vivarian's brain scan lives on and isn't limited by its content from the origin from the originating brain scan read emerged the read inside the vivarium was a perfect copy i have it i can save humanity i can build an art of so she didn't actually invent it it sort of just happened 
I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with the Vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. It was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow... Uh, the diffraction and high energy needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW's been using this seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the mockingbirds. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. So the mockingbirds, I assume, are things that, like, sort of AI programs that will mimic people. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we will launch it into space using the space gun. Space gun. It's nice to think something will live on like that. Mark Sarang killed himself after a scan. He has been suggesting everyone should kill themselves as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the ARC. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Stromheimer is not happy with me. Hope it will calm down. That doesn't really make any sense. I mean, it makes sense in that, like, having t in your in your brain, you think, oh, there's two of me alive. Like, one's the real me and one's the fake me. If I kill this me, I will live on in a reincarnated form in, um, maybe that kind of hints at, like, the Buddhism statues back there, you know? Like, you'll have a reincarnated form. Although, I'm pretty sure if you kill yourself in Buddhism, you don't get to go up a level or anything. I think you go down a few levels in, like incarnation you know like instead of being a human you're like a bug or something which gave me a set of ai templates i haven't seen before i'm fully one of them to make a new friend for capsule catherine and her gang of legacies new way to simulate turbulence makes the weather system so much better implemented reed didn't go well new try with reed reed won't play nicely with the others she is too real okay so this the scanned reed the one that is actually her brain scan doesn't like the 2D ones, or like the sort of ones that are like 2D-ish. Which is what we were. Us as legacy scans. Why do you have a creepy marionette in your room? You have a beanie? Cute. Anything in the drawers? I haven't been looking in the drawers. She probably doesn't have anything. A hairbrush. And a Japanese doll. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to do that, Japanese doll. Is this a... Oh, it's her blanket. I was like, is that a sleeping bag under her bed? Dead plant. Boring stuff. Boring, boring. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Martin Fisher. Okay, this is... Okay. <laughs> <sighs> Unpleasant! Oh, but there is... Hang on. There's a Healy button in here. Like that. I don't like that dripping noise being behind. I really don't like that. Nope. Well, there's there's definitely one in that hallway. <gasps> there probably isn't one in this hallway. I think my brain would be reacting to it even through the wall. Why is there creepy music? Why is there blood? Who is this? Hang on. Mark Soret. Oh, this is the guy who killed himself first. Oh, so it's showing how WoW is corrupting. Oh, wait. Is it pointing to, like, is that a creature, or is it just a mass in the wall? Because, like, that's the, the, the glowing wow corrupting the, uh, the, like, power boxes. 
Is that like the faceless horror? Please, no, I don't. I would. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, energy comes out of it. Equations come out of it. Yes. Uh, more equations. Boop boop boop. Uh, yeah. Okay. Clarity. Chem lab. Are some of these useful? That one doesn't tell me what room that's in. Nope. No, I can't read it. Anyway, equations, math. Oh, that's not blood, it's just a red marker. Why is my nose always itchy when I'm streaming? Or not streaming, but I guess using the camera. Brain stuff. <gasps> is this the book? Is this one of the books I found in my room? your body or your surroundings if confined or define you. They're all very difficult ideas to approach without having your questions invalidated by practical or mystified by the spiritual mind. Oh, great thinkers about identity. Reading about identity can be like really trippy, honestly. Like, what's your sense of self? What does it mean to be human? Dear friends, when you read this, I will have entered the Ark. As I've explained, this is accomplished by cause... Ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. To not frighten Catherine. Is it gonna, to not frighten Catherine, I will do this in s secret by folding cyanide pills into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announce completion, I will bite down, quickly causing my own demise. Unless not, cyanide pills aren't always a surefire way to die. When you discover the, the something behind my death, the reason? No, there's no something to mourn for I am victorious. I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the Ark. You would have been in the Ark anyway, broski. Like, that's what I don't really get posted in. Is that, like, you're in the Ark, but you're also just letting your other self be alive out here. You know? There's just two of you operating. Guy Conrad. I don't remember your name, Guy Conrad, and I'm sorry. <laughs> Why would these people... Oh, maybe these people died before things went to crap, you know, so their rooms were locked up when everybody was still sane. Is that like a fa I think it's supposed to be a drill, but it looks like a fallout gun. Oh, what were you making? Master... Ma Maser tool safety? Are, are you showing a way... I think it's she's showing a way to bypass something? Uh, but if I have to bypass something, I'll kill Catherine. Potentially. Well, this person liked space. Oh, hey, there's that picture, and there's a picture of a car. Nice. They managed to decorate their room quite nicely. I'm not sure if I should touch that health pack yet, or if I should wait. I feel like I should maybe wait, but I don't know. I don't know. I still don't know. Fuck! <laughs> I still don't know if waiting is a good idea. Oh my gosh. Uh, I can't, I can't. Oh, why is this so scary? I don't like it. Catherine, you go downstairs. I know I'm the one with the body, but frick. Go alive? downstairs and reset the router. Okay. I just need to hear another voice. Okay. Alright, it's fine. Mm, it's not fine because it's not the same creatures that I've been dealing with up until now, I think. They are different. Is my my light is on. Ah! 
<sighs> that red light scared the crap out of me because the pictures have been showing a red light. Bathroom. Oh, wait, what? Oh, am I gonna like scare myself? Wow. Wow. Okay, I didn't think they were. I was like, oh, ho, ho, look, we can't see ourselves in the reflection. Okay, well, at least the awareness didn't, um, like, the awareness of ourselves didn't, like, make us go insane or give us terrible flashbacks or something. That's always a positive. We've recognized our appearance. And this is probably just another bad thing. Oh, it doesn't seem like there's anything hidden in the bathroom. Okay, the stairs were over there. Oh my gosh. Let's see. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything is not fine, in fact. But I could, nope, I can't go up or down. Everything's been horribleized, and I have to go down that hallway. And that stuff was making noises. I don't appreciate it. Is she watching me? Is something watching me? I don't know. Is it time to be done yet? <sighs> I am not ready. I don't even know if I can actually get through here, but... Hmm. Maybe I can't. Oh, well, no, the window's not big enough. Okay, now I'm actually... Oh, okay, here's another one. I wonder if there's mm, a secret in these rooms that'll get me. We're all we're all die anyway. I'm all in. I put my faith in Sarang and the continuity. Oh, and this is like a happy family that is not happy anymore. Oh dang, does she have kids like back on Earth? Or, or is this just what she's hoping it would be? Like, this is her and her friends. No, that kid, that one's got a balloon, so I think that's, like, a kid. A cat. Oh, I bet you that's one of the developer's cats. Wow, she was obsessed with Earth. Oh, no. Oh, she... Okay. Okay, yes, I get it. She killed herself here. With a knife? I mean, I guess she doesn't have much else, but... Oh, that's a, that's, a, that's, a, that's a difficult way to go. It is not quick. Oh, that's her big aunt. Sarang was her husband, I get. Maybe. I don't know. I think maybe he was her husband. Maybe I should be opening these. Well, now I don't... Mm. Oh, lights. Nice. Here I am, being all gloom and doom. Where is that? Glasses. Okay, well, now I am a little stuck. Is that anything in there? I say, not minding at all. Maybe I need to poke this. Oh. 
it might be removing... What the hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. Helps me focus. That's... I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. <sighs> Let's just keep going. Well... No, okay, it didn't, it didn't do what I wanted to do. Do I gotta, like, lure the creature over here? And then have it break through for me? Because if it can break through things... I thought that desk was a person. I almost screamed. Okay, it's fine. Turn on all the freaking lights. Uh, do you have anything useful? Mr. Brain Chemist. No. I personally think it's really selfish of him to go and kill himself. If he's got loved ones behind. You know. Oh wait, there should be something in... There should be something in Catherine's room. Why? What? What? Catherine, what is this? Catherine. Your teddy bear could use some more pictures. <laughs> Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling over. He is absolutely terrifying. I'm putting him back in there. Nope. Okay, he can go on the couch. You don't have to search my room. We'll get by. Yeah, well, I don't know what to do now. You're like, go downstairs, and my only route that I thought I was avoiding. Not, not even that one. It was the other stairs that are blocked. Now I'm not sure. Go downstairs. Oh, I could turn the lights back. I can turn the lights. Oh no, I can't turn the lights back. Yes? You have something to say to me? It is saying something. <laughs> this one looks like it's made up of a lot more organic material than before. Oh, that's really gross, actually. Oh. Um. All right, now I feel bad. Um. I went in there. That's her office. Um. I mean that that window isn't. It, I could probably break it, but it's it's uh I think too small. How do you get in these doors that you don't want to get into? Ooh, I'm a little lost. Oh, jeez. Let's turn all the lights on and make myself feel better. It's a lie. But, you know. one might have to be cut a little short, I guess. I'm trying to think. That door had no way of being open. And I don't know of any other way. We... Uh, Strasky? Come in? Yeah, we did that one. If I deleted my data, what would that do? Well, this broke through that window. Can I drop down the elevator shaft? No. That's good. I 
don't think there's a secret. There's like stuff rolling around on the floor and it's scaring the crap out of me. Okay, maybe let's try breaking the window. Uh, maybe we'll get something's attention. It's exactly, it's exactly what I want. Tee hee hee hee. Tee hee hee hee. Okay. Nope. Maybe it's not heavy enough. This is, this is actually probably a soft, softer ball, honestly. All right. Pretty sure this would make it explode or something. Okay, here, let's go. No. Yeah, I'm missing up the lights have all turned off. I told you. To oh no, this room, I don't. Did this room have it? I don't think that room could have lights on because I pulled the power source. Maybe I really don't like that sound in the background. I don't know what that is. It's a mouse. Would tell me. Oh, hey, by the way, this is why what you did was not so great. Oh, that's like the vent. It feels so much. Does my flashlight like get dimmer? The more I use it? I think it does, actually. Alright, well, I guess I'll call this one short for now. Can I? I don't know. Break emergency life support. Will that cause something to happen? Nope. Unless there's a clue hidden somewhere in these rooms I can access, I'm I'm a bit of a, I'm, a, I'm at a bit of a loss, which is fine. I don't mind. She's like, you don't have to go through my room, and I'm like, hmm. But yeah, uh, I'm sorry to kind of end it on such a, you know, wobbly note. I don't know what, like an an undefined note. If I can't figure something out in the next few minutes when I turn it on, I will maybe just like look up, you know, like the first sentence of a walkthrough, like for this particular area. So. Unless I go look back at the map, I need to remember actually, what I'll probably do is go back and look at the map really quick. See if that helps me. But for now, I'm gonna log off. Oh no. I just need to get this stuff done, but oh my gosh. Maybe next time I'll have I'll have company. I know I mentioned that last time, but next time I might actually have company if my family comes to visit. So or my at least my sister. And then I'll make her sit here when she can't hear anything, but she'll be here and I can punch her. Anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying this far, and hopefully next time we can at least um, check the map. And then if that doesn't work, I will check a walkthrough as very spoilerish, like spoilerless as possible. So, thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.